so I'm still waiting for my Mikita stuff to pack up so I can eventually go to Milwaukee and if you know about this giveaway that I'm doing at the end of the month for a Milwaukee soldering iron with the whole pack the battery and the iron get involved you can get yourself one of them so I'm slowly moving to Milwaukee but what I'm fed up with doing is carrying this bag around it's heavy <coughs> to get out all the time to go to someone's house. So, what I've bought myself is some pack out kit. So this is my plan to make myself handy to have some pack out kit for when I eventually transcribe over or whatever you call it. Turn over to basically Milwaukee, everything. The SCS still still going, so I don't need to get one. So let's pack this out, see what I can get inside here. But when I did get this pack out kit, they also gave me a snood and a t-shirt that I'm gonna give away with the uh, soldering iron. So make sure to get in that competition because yeah, there's gonna be some good stuff to give away there. Right, so there's your t-shirt. Look at this, it's got a little bit on there as well. It's nice. So there's a Milwaukee t-shirt to go with it. But I need to pack this out. Yeah, so these were just a few bits that I got from Alex as well, which I'll tell you about them in another video. Free bottle of water. I don't like that water. That's for the dog. Some pens and someone's business card. Nice. Hey, up some old teasers. Let's take this out and see what we can get inside this. Basically, I'm fed up with carrying everything around. But I'm going to separate it up. So basically, I want to get my batteries. I'm thinking that the batteries, are they going to sit in there? Nope, they've got to lay down flat. So my batteries can sit in that bit. This can be, because they'll all sit together, is the plan. That could sit in there. Don't know where I'm going to separate that at the minute. Back out resistance. Hey, we've got some ideas on there, what we can use it for. So then you're gonna get a drill in there, that'll be fine. Let's take this off and then put another battery in there. And then we've got a little impact to go in there as well. We put both of them impacts together down there. And that can go in there. The hacksaw I carry in this as well. Don't know why. And then the drill bits. I need to get the drill bits in the little pack out kit that goes on the top. Take this battery out as well. Because the only problem with that bag is as well, if they crush up, then the battery's gone all overnight and waste them out. So what I'm going to do, put this in there as well. Ah, it's a bit tight. In there. Because I want this one, there's another impact. I don't know why I've got two of everything, but I have. And then the charger needs to go in there, unfortunately, somewhere as well. It's a big old charger. So that needs to fit in there to charge the batteries. The torch that I never use, I can sit in that Makita bag still. I've never used that. Uh, there's another battery, you can go in there. Another torch, oh, don't use that either. Now the multi-tool, I'm wondering if this can go in there with it, let's take the blade off. So I can fit everything in this box. I don't need that blade, that can go somewhere else. That can go in there. I'm not gonna need that anymore. So more batteries. This is all I've got to figure out how I'm going to fit them all in. Because that lid ain't going to shut with them batteries in there. But then the drill bits as well. The drill bits are going to have to go in there because I'm drilling. I need them. So 
so that will sit in there as well in that box my little pog sharpener so the reason why i got this that ain't gonna shut with that in fantastic to so put that in there reason why i got this to fit on top so i can put things like this in here a little sharpener for that Some more bleeding business cards and then what i want to do is put my hole saws in here as well well that one not going to go in is it is it egg right so i might need to think of something where to put them in but then i can fit the hole saws all in there no 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 that hole saw that can go in there so many different sizes of bleeding hole saws oh look i've got a little milwaukee stanley let's put that in there as well ah uh, that will be handy to go inside there so i'm going to pack this out it might take me a little while to find out where things are going to go and i'll show you it once i've done so this is how far i've got I've got the drills and the batteries and the charger, everything in, oh, different size hole saws, the Dade and some SDS bits, but they'll go with the SDS drill. And it's in there mainly. And then I've also separated up, and shut that up, nice and neat. And then what I've also got is these, which will fit on top, which will be easy to get to the job, where it's all separated up with the uh, uh, the multi-tool sharpener, the spice, and little bits and bobs, and the little pog sharpener, and some hole saws. So they're all separated up nice, which is exactly what I wanted. And then, I've got this as well. If I can shove it on. And about, we'll put them on there. There we go, nice one in. And then this one has also, hang about, oh, got... in it ah the drill bits and you go through these quite a bit so and they're different size torx heads and need them sometimes but then what i've found out is that it's all fantastic i've got the new bits and that in there but it's not enough how i want to separate up nicely and i've still got to throw some stuff away but i don't throw stuff away because it'll come in handy so milwaukee I'll be seeing you soon. I need some more.